Well, this is our International Youth Day event. It's our seventh annual event. Uh, we've been doing this for uh, seven years now and uh, it's in celebration of International Youth Day and we get about 60 to 65 young workers from across the province in for a two-day meeting and we discuss various issues surrounding young workers and it's a great educational opportunity for new members of our union to get exposed to union activities. I, I felt engaged at every single mini course, every one of the, sing of the workshops. I was, I was engaged, I was awake, I learned so much. PYC is the Provincial Young Workers Committee. So our committee is tasked with empowering young workers to get involved, uh, become activists. Um, we motivate young workers to become involved in the union uh, with succession planning and to develop our skills to become the future leaders of the union uh, and the labor movement. Je trouve que la conférence est utile. Uh, les ateliers sont vraiment informatifs, c'est utile parce qu'on peut utiliser l'information lorsqu'on revient chez nous. The question of apathy is thrown around a lot when we're talking about young people. Um, I personally don't think that that's the real issue. I think that there are so many competing demands on people's time that it's it's disenfranchisement, it's not apathy. And so if it's if it's if it's apathy, it means that they actually don't care. Um, and if you ask any young worker, do you want a higher wage? Do you want more protections at work? Um, I would be shocked if you found a young worker who's like, I don't care about young um, about wages, right? Uh, for example. And so what we need to do is find uh, the issues that young workers care about, we need to find ways to plug them in, um, and we need to find um, we need to find leadership among young workers and, and, and make sure that they're being supported, that they're being developed, and that they're being given the opportunity to help inspire the people within their, work, their workspace. <laughs> Uh, I think the conference is actually enlightening and empowering. I think it's important for young people to get involved and I think that's enlightening to see so many young activists and with such passion for the union. Uh, I think we got a great bunch of young people here. I think they, uh, they look enthused uh, and uh, I'm, I'm very I'm very optimistic, I'm very happy for the future because I think, uh, you know, we as a union, and I think the union movement, uh, events like this are important. You have to have these events. Uh, you have to engage your youth, you have to engage your, your union, you have to engage your members to ensure that, you know, that uh, the union stays strong. Um, I mean, when you have a strong union, you have a strong society. <laughs> This is the largest International Youth Day ever. And this is gonna get super, super huge. We have just started. Opsu will watch out for the youth voice. We will definitely be at the convention floor. We will definitely advocate for our issues and this crowd is gonna get bigger. I would encourage every new worker that is interested in, in getting more involved in the union to attend this event. It is a great opportunity to, to come out and meet new people, share experiences, and to, to gain that knowledge. Um, we, we are developing the future leaders of the labor movement here. And I would encourage everyone, um, new members to OPSU, young workers who want to get more involved, to come out and experience this. We need you to get involved in the union. We need you to run for leadership positions. We need you to run for the executive board because you're, it's going to be your union. The, the day is going to come that you're going to be, uh, one of you will be standing here like me saying to the generation coming up, you know, please get active, please get involved so you can take over from us. Yeah.